Vlogmas day seven. So I just got my Starbucks and of course I had to get a water. I cannot have coffee without my water. An appointment at 11.30 today for the dermatologist. So it's about nine now. So we're gonna go home, relax for a little bit, drink my coffee and get this little one some breakfast. Cause she hasn't had an official breakfast. I just gave her a snack while we were getting in the car and of course her milk. Right, so we are at Safeway. I had to get some more bread and just a couple of things. She's having fun eating the bread. Ooh, that looks good, but not healthy. Please don't drop the bread, sweetie. She's through this like dropping, throwing phase right now. She wants out, <laughs> but she has no shoes on. She ripped them off in the car and I just wanted to make this a quick, quick trip. I don't know what else we need. Ooh, cauliflower pizza crust, that looks good. Lots of new pizzas. I got your little tummy got home from the store. Adriana is taking a nap right now. I'm going to put all of these groceries away. I ended up getting a lot more than I thought I was going to or that I said I was going to, but we did need all of this stuff. So I got this clover ice cream. It's like organic ice cream, but it was actually on sale. Um, salted caramel cookie crunch. We actually don't have any ice cream, so I figured I would get more. And then I did get a pizza for Sunday night. I'm trying to be better at planning our dinners, so I got the cheese stuffed. We love this one. Eggs. I think I'm actually going to make eggs for myself for breakfast this morning. I've been waking up with headaches and I don't know if it's because I wait so long to eat. I mean, it's only 10 o'clock right now, but I have a headache. I, I don't know why I keep getting them. I don't know if it's just like my hormones or I'm not drinking enough water or, you know, maybe it's because I'm not eating until like 10 or 11. I really don't know what it is, but I've never really been someone to get headaches, so it's just kind of weird. And I've been to the doctors for it and they said that everything was fine. Um, and so I don't know. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it could be. If you guys have any suggestions on what it could be, it's kind of just feels like a tension headache. Like it's not super bad. It's just like, it's there. Like my, I just, it's a tech attention. I don't know. So hopefully it goes away once I like eat or something. More bread and the meat for the meatloaf. And then some cheese, which we always get the big giant bags of cheese because we love cheese and we go through it like crazy. And then Adriana was hungry in the grocery store and I didn't really know what to get her. So I found these in the aisle. We love these, you guys know that. And so she really likes them. I ended up just getting like a little small pouch. More pasta roni. This one is the butter and garlic. We will be having this with dinner as well tonight. Jordan loves them. And so I know that we just had them, but he loves them. So every time he comes, I feel like I always give him those. And um, some whole wheat rotini. You guys know we got to keep our pasta stock up for Adriana because she is obsessed with pasta. And then I found these little Kodiak cakes. I thought that they were the ones that we usually get from, um, I went to a different Safeway today because I was out of town. So the ones that we get from our regular Safeway are like the pancake ones that I was showing you guys in yesterday's vlog that Adriana has been eating. But I found the oatmeal ones that I've never seen. These are the peanut butter chocolate chip. They have 14 grams of protein, non-GMO. If I end up liking them, I'll probably end up getting more and having them for breakfast. Then I got some more Prego traditional sauce. We use this for spaghetti and we'll be using it for meatloaf as well. So I have to clean up my kitchen. My kitchen is honestly a mess. I need to put all of these dishes away and PJ forgot to put away the spaghetti from last night. So we have to basically throw that away. Such a waste. But he forgot. I told him like after I was done with the dishes, I went to go take a shower and then I said like, hey, can you put the spaghetti away? And he's like, yeah, sure. And then he just like spaced and forgot. So I gotta go and clean up my kitchen now and figure out what I'm gonna have for breakfast. Okay, so I didn't have a 
chance to get ready yet for the day. Like I didn't do my makeup or anything, but I did get Adriana ready. We are at my dermatologist appointment right now. She's eating a cracker. I'm hoping that this appointment goes fast because I don't know how good she's gonna do. And I had to wake her up from her nap. So yeah, she wasn't necessarily the happiest. This is how it is bringing a baby to an appointment. <laughs> Boo, come here, babe. Everything's so excited for her in here. There's like so much stuff for her to touch, even though I'm having anxiety about her touching everything because it's really dirty, so. All right guys, so I got ready. As you guys can tell, I did my makeup. We are going to pick up Jordan now. Thank you. PJ and it's road rage. And that guy was staring at me. Yeah, there's a place over here called, I think it's Voodoo Donuts or something donuts, but I would never eat it's from like, a place called Voodoo Donuts. Is it called? It's called, it's something. It's a donut place that has like weird donuts and they, they have jalapeno donuts and like weird things, Who but they're the super fuck popular. Who the jalapeno donut? That is the complete opposite. That's like Impractical Jokers when they came out with jalapeno milk. Who the hell would drink that? People do. You would eat a jalapeno donut? No, but people do eat it and they enjoy it. No, they have different ones like fruity pebbles and like like cinnamon toast Can crunch. I just get like, like different some ones. donut holes. He just wants to be basic. Jordan's with a friend at this rock and jump place. Yeah, starting a having so starting much fun. His birthday weekend early. I know. He's just having an eventful weekend. Lucky kid. We're at the Christmas tree lighting. We finally found parking. Adriana's down here kicking her blanket off. But Jordan. There, we fixed it. Jordan is waiting in line for Santa and Mrs. Claus. So cute. Yeah, they love it. Yeah, they're so cute. Mom and Dad. I knew it. Yeah. I love it too. I just it's like magic. I like you know? just got back from the Christmas tree lighting. We got Chipotle for dinner, so we just got a little quick takeout. You can't go wrong with Chipotle. It was so much fun. We've seen a lot of people down there. We just love our little small town, and it's a yearly thing that we always go to. We were all dressed up really warm, and we weren't super cold like we were last year. Adriana was super bundled up and warm, so it was definitely an enjoyable time. And Jordan got popcorn and met Santa and Mrs. Claus and. It was just a blast. Oh, and a little update on PJ. So far, so good with the whole meat eating incident. He seemed to be fine today, so I don't think it was anything to do with Taco Bell. Fingers crossed. <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave me a big thumbs up. Hit that notification bell to be notified when I've uploaded a new video. And subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in tomorrow's Vlogmas. Bye.